I. In this class, we're going to look at matrices for equation, okay? Matrices for equation. So let's look at this. If A is equal to this and B is equal to this, we should find C if AC is equal to B. This will lead us to what? Equation. Okay? So what are we saying? The question is saying, this is A, that is 1, 3, 2, and 4. We are looking for another matrix that is C. Let's call it A, B, C, D, like this. These are the elements of the matrix C. We don't know the elements. That is what we are going to look at. Okay, we will be solving for each of these elements. Is equal to B. That is minus 3, 1, 2, and 4. So this is our A, this is our C, this is our B. Following this. So we are looking for C according to this question. So this is what we are looking for. Okay, so let's do that. So what we're going to do now is to multiply, first of all, this by this. Because this means multiply, multiply. This multiply by this, plus this multiply by this. That is, A plus 2C. Then this multiply by this, this multiply by this. That is, B plus 2D. This multiply by this, this multiply by this. That is, 3a plus 4c. This multiply by this, this multiply by this. That is 3b 4d. All equal to this. That is equal to minus 3, 1, 2, and 4. So what is this telling us? This is simply telling us now that what this is equal to this. That is a plus 2c is equals to minus 3. Okay? We can call that equation 1. This is equals to this. That is, B plus 2D is equals to 2. This is 3A plus 4C is equals to 1. Why 3B plus 4D is equals to 4. Now, we can solve for A, B, C, and D. Okay, from equation 1, let's find A. From 1, let's what? Find A. That is, A is equals to minus 3 minus 2C. What we are going to do next now is to substitute the value of this A in one of this. If you look at this very well, we have A, we have C here. We are going to look for another equation that has A and C because they are friends. This one is A and C, this is not A and C, this is also A and C. So we are going to go with this. That is to say, theory A plus 4c is equal to 1. So we are going to substitute this in this place. Theory A will be minus 3 minus 2c plus 4c equal to 1. Okay? Then we work on this. That is minus 9 minus 6c plus 4c equals to 1. So with this now, we have minus 9. This we produce minus 2c equals to 1 which is minus 9, this one will come to this side to become minus 1, this goes to this side to become 2c, okay? This is minus 10 equals to 2c. We divide both sides by 2. You agree with me? This will cancel this. This will produce 5 here. It means our c therefore is minus 5. That is the first element we are getting. c as minus 5. So with this now, we go for A. From this, from this, we now know that 
c is minus 5, we can boldly take this, that is, minus 3, minus 2, minus 5, okay? Then this equals to minus 3 plus 10, which is 7. a therefore is 7. Once we have these two values, we can look at this now to see we have here b and d. We have here b and d. So first of all, let's use the second equation to get b. That is, from here now, b is equal to 2 minus 2d. Okay? So from here now, we can substitute in place of b to say 3 in place of this b, we put 2 minus 2d. Okay? Plus 4d equals to 4. Okay? That is 6 minus 6d plus 4d equals to 4. This will produce 6 minus 2d equals to 4, which is minus 2d equals to 4 minus 6, which is equals to minus 2 minus 2d. The Bible side by minus 2, you agree with me, we're going to have 1 as our d. I've done that. We now have D. What is remaining now is B. So we are going to come back to this place to say B is equal to 2 minus 2D, which is 2 minus 2. D is 1 according to this value, which is 2 minus 2, 0. So our B is 0. Because we now have all the values, we can go back to this place now and find C. So this is producing C for us. The first value is A. And we got our A to be what? To be 7. So we put 7 here. The next one is B. According to this, so you can see in this place, this is B, C, D. So our B is what? Our B is 0. Our C is minus 5. And our D is 1. So this is what we are looking for. The value for C. Hope this is understood. Thank you for viewing.